Good morning, everyone. This is Lisa from Happy to Hook Creations. Um, today is Thursday, January 9th. And um, I've, although he will not see this video, his mother, my sister-in-law will, I would like to wish my nephew Christopher a happy 26th birthday. Oh my gosh. Ooh, they're getting up there. <laughs> anyway, um, hope everybody's having a great day. I have got a yarn haul. I used my two of my gift certificates or gift cards that I received for Christmas, and my items came yesterday. It's so nice to come home from work and have like boxes right in front of your door that all said Amazon. And um, I spoke <laughs> Jack. Jack came home for lunch and he he sends me a message. You have boxes. Yeah, you have boxes. I go from Amazon, right? And he says, yes. And I go, remember, I used my gift card because he used to, it, it's like the going joke now because he would always say, I'm going to divorce you if there's one more Amazon box left on my porch. Um, he says it said that, that um, he feels like he should invite the Amazon guy into the house because they're on a first name basis. <laughs> it's not that bad. Maybe. I don't know. Anyway. <laughs> I got some stuff to show you guys. You know what's so awesome? <sighs> Not spending your own money on yarn. That's what's awesome. So, um, yeah, I I don't think I went a little nutty. I, I was looking for specific yarn this time because, you know, I'm, um, I'm, I'm kind of downsizing <laughs> some of the yarn that I don't use. But I also... Um, I'm working on projects, so I needed the yarn for that, right? So yeah, I have to get some. So I wrote it down. I don't know where my receipt was, but I know uh, I looked back on my history for Amazon. And so I don't know which ones were which, but the most I paid for the yarn that I'm going to show you was $6.31. The lower amount was $5.19 and then $5.69. So that's how much they they were for, I don't know, how many I got. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Looks like I got ten of them. So I've been using um, Bernat Blanket Yarn, which I absolutely love. Oh, I love that yarn. I love it. Um, and I always think of, I mean, a lot of us podcasters use them, but I know that Seta absolutely loves it as well. And I wanted to try different colors that I hadn't tried before, or I, um, I also bought a few colors that I wanted to go with what I already had in stock to make larger blankets. Because one of these, it's the 10 and a half ounce um, skein of yarn. It will make, a, it will make a, a baby blanket. It may not be a big one, and I size-wise, I have no idea. Because it depends on the stitch that you use, the needle that you use. I like making them in a tight stitch with a Q hook, um, like a single crochet, because they're... it's tight together and they make really great uh tummy time mats or you know maybe covering the baby up in the in the winter um or just to not have so much of the air when it's hot because you know that the um the air conditioning it can get it can get cold I don't know maybe that's just me but that's my thinking that's that's my process so um I just wanted to get a little extra because I want whenever I have time I want to crochet something that's um I always do, but I want to make sure that I get something done and get it finished, which is why I've been picking projects that are not going to take a long time, which is why I showed you all those hats in the last video, because they were 30 minutes or less, quick, quick thing to, to whip up. And you know, it's still winter. So, you know, if you're looking for a nice gift or something, those hats would be perfect. If you're wanting to make a baby blanket, these are great too. So let me show you. Um, I also, not only did I go to Amazon, I got all my Amazon yesterday, but um, I used my Joanne Fabrics um, gift card and I went there the other day. So I still have the stuff in the bag to show you. So let me get started. The first one, and I'm going to leave them in the plastic, guys, um, because I've got, you know, my closet is, is full and my daughter has been helping me get everything organized and I have one large box of just my Bernat yarn. So when I went through it, that's when I knew what I needed and what I want to make. So if I leave them in here, I know they'll still, <laughs> there won't be any dust or anything. That sounds silly. Eh. Do you leave yours in your bag? Let me know. I'm just curious. So here it is. This was the first color, which I thought is gorgeous. Look at that. Um, it is called Doo -doo -doo, Baby Teal. 
just baby teal and it is the super bulky so it's a number six ten and a half ounces and let's see i wanted to see i, I believe it's like two oh let me see we would put the paper right where i i need it oh sorry guys yeah it's 220 yards so nothing's changed there so but yeah i thought that was a good color and i purchased two of those so let me sit those over there so they're out of the way and i also bought this one is to make a shark blanket which is why i got gray but it is pale gray that's what this one is called same 10 and a half ounce ball and i hope you can see that through the plaid yeah you should be able to it's just like a really pale gray so there's two of those i might toss them over in the <laughs> there now this particular one i have already i have um two small ones and those i think are five five ounces five and a half ounces but two of them will equal one so and this color is called pitter patter and this is one of my favorites i love 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 that one see all those nice little colors in there it looks so pretty when it's put together so two of those and yeah, got to have purple. Just got to have it. This is baby lilac. And I got two of those as well. But, you know, it's a good deal. You know, I think these are regularly $10. And Joanne Fabrics had them on sale, but they were $7.99. And I didn't have a coupon to use. Um, and, I, you know, I was almost, most of these were $2 less than what they had on sale at Joann. So even with a coupon, I still saved getting it on Amazon. So there are those two. And then I picked a color I had never used before, but I thought it was really pretty. Um, oh, well, this one's popping out of it. I don't know if pretty is the word, but it's just really nice. And this one is called Sailor's Delight. And I just love the colors in here. So since this one's, sorry about the rustling, I really am. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? I just love all those colors together. Looks very, very nice. And I got this. I, I didn't even realize it, but I have a teal. And then I have this color, like that sand, maybe. I don't know if it's sand color. But it, it just, it looks really nice. And I really like that one. It's kind of like a, um, oh, I don't know. Not coral, but I don't know. Light rust, whatever it is, I love it. And, of course, I got two of those. So... We'll make a nice little a nice little blanket and so when i went to joanne fabrics so that was it for my amazon when i went to joanne fabrics they did have some blanket yarn on sale so i did buy some um so i'll just show you one because i got four of those um yeah <laughs> uh so these are the baby blanket stripes that's what I have. And this is also, oh, if I would stop reading it upside down, it is just as, just like the skeins I just showed you. It's 10 and a half ounces, 300 grams, 220 yards. And this color, I don't know why I rolled that all the way around. Tiny teal. That's what this is called. But I love it. Look at that. Look at those colors. So I did get four of these because they were $5 a piece. Um, they were pretty much... They had like one of this or two of those. And I wanted something to make a large blanket with. So this was the only color that they had that had more than two or three. So I bought the the four. I think they had, did they have five of these? Or maybe I just bought all the, or all four of the ones that they had. So yeah. So that's, I don't know. I just thought that, oh, that's the other side. So this side has the teal in the middle and that side has, that's kind of interesting. But yeah, I thought that was really cute. So there you go. Um, and I didn't, I didn't go overboard because I want to save my, in case they have a really good sale. Um, not that they didn't. So, oh, here's the receipt. All right. So, yep. So the Burnett Tiny Teal Stripes were regular price, $10.99, and I got them for $5 a piece. And then the other ones that I'm going to show you, which was the Red Heart Heat Wave. That's what I bought. 
they were $2.97 and then they were an additional 20% off, which took it down to $2.38 a skein. Um, and I did get six of them. And let's see. So these are the first two. You guys know how this color is probably for Amanda. I always, I'm always doing that. So this color is Beach Ball. It's a number four ply and it's three and a half ounces, 100 grams, 198 yards or 181 meters. So yeah. And this is heat generated yarn, sunlight activated, even on cloudy days. That's what it says. So there's that. So if you have a join fabrics, um, looks, it, I, they look interesting to me. So I know I bought some in teal or turquoise. I haven't used it yet. I don't think, um, this color I love, you know, guys, I love green and this is called seaweed. So I thought that was a really pretty color. And this might be included because I am working on getting a temperature blanket. This weekend, I'm going to be in my craft room, moving some things around and checking colors. And I thought these three would be nice for a blanket. Who knows? This color is bikini. That's what it says. But I thought it was really pretty shade of pink. I love it. So I'm going to toss these back in. So yeah, so that's what I got. Um, I still have a Michaels card that I haven't used yet because we don't have a Michaels in town. And I've just been really busy with um, traveling for work. And we don't, um, I don't do the county that's in Springfield. So it's like, oh, when do I go? So maybe this weekend, if I have enough time, maybe Sunday, I'll head over there um, and then call my daughter, Jessica. And maybe she can meet me at Michael's and we can go shopping. So who knows? Um, but that is it for now. Uh, I am going to go to Walmart. I have no idea if they have any sales going on or anything left over from the holidays, but you know, if I go to Walmart, I'm going to go to the yarn section and see what they have. So if I come up with anything interesting, I will definitely let you guys know. Um, otherwise definitely check out Amazon. I'll get a link and, um, uh, put it down here so you guys can just click on that and check and see if they're still on sale. Cause this was about a week ago that I ordered them. And also uh, Joanne Fabrics. So you guys have a wonderful day. And I will talk to you later. See you when I see ya. Bye.